the warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. The teams then, England against Russia. My name's Peter Drury, and here's my co-commentator for the game, it's Jim Beglin. Thanks for that, Peter. Hi, everyone. The excitement has really picked up now, and I'm eager for the action to start. The supporters on all four sides rise for the national anthems. England go for this lineup. Hart, Hart's goal, Cahill, Smalling, Klein, Shaw, Choncho Shelby, Milner, Delph, Oxlade Chamberlain, Sterling, Rooney, tasked with leading the line. I'm going to go for the experienced ego I can fail. He's always been an agile stopper, but having been on the scene from, from such a young age, he's a much calmer decision maker these days. I'm thinking the same. He will be a central feature, no doubt. Danger averted for now. Berezutsky. Not much subtlety, he's launched himself there. Sterling! He's gone a long way up and away. Balls loose, who's getting there? Oh, great ball! Wayne Rooney! Only him! Well, if that was their intention pre-match, let me tell you, it's worked out very nicely. I think for the skipper to chip in with a goal, too, is a bonus. But this game has already taken on a real attacking edge, and, and long may that continue. Oh, high-quality goal. Lovely first touch, sumptuous second. Russia trail at this early stage. How will they respond? England making the ideal start. It is something to build on. Always when you score early, it gives you such a lift and it, it casts down the minds of your opponents at the same time. And that pretty much sums up the difference in what we've seen. One team assured, the other a little unsure. Tries to dink it in. Shade too heavy. Keeper can pick that up. Cahill looks it towards the front. England are very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. It's Rooney! Wayne Rooney! Only him! And already they're looking to run away with it. What a clean hit. No one gets in the way of that. Well, the technique generates the power in that situation, and once power is assured, any goalkeeper's up against it. England get themselves a two-goal cushion. That second goal is such a, a polarizing effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. 
Ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. He has done it! Just one in it now! The game takes on a whole new complexion! Perfect placement, the one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. This is threatening to become a really good game. Well, it was important they didn't get ahead of themselves and lose their discipline. This game plan could near well reward them with an equaliser. Jagoev. So midway through the first half, and it is a tight old tie. Kokorin looking up to see who wants it. Kokorin. Cahill goes long and forward. Now it's Sterling. Oxlade Chamberlain. Rooney. And the ball's come loose, and the chase is on. That's a half decent try. Well, the keeper was helpless then, he knew he wasn't getting to it, so for a second or two he must have been praying it was off target, and he got lucky, very lucky. Oh, that's great stuff, exactly what he's all about. Oh, he's just a nightmare for any defence, his movement, his pace, his anticipation, it's on another level, it's so hard for any defence to contain that. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Rooney gets into a dangerous position. Cochrane. It was a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. And it's Rooney. England are ahead here, and it's been a good half for them. Good idea, just poorly executed. Direct. It's Oxley Chamberlain! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Well, I think the opposition was pretty sloppy in creating a problem for themselves then, but he was onto it so quickly and, and very nearly made them pay. That's a poor kick by the keeper, he's just given it straight back. Belts one! Dmitry Kombarov plays a clever pass. Klein. And it's half time here. Very little in it. The score at half time is two goals to one. Second half gets on the way. Beresutsky. Cochrane. Truthfully, it was hard to see any better outcome there. Sterling. Delph. Sterling. And the defence can get it clear. Ignashevich, Jagoev, Cochrane, Samadov pumps it upfield, and it's the goalkeepers to claim. Shaw, thrust towards the front line.
Smalling going full tilt down the left. Now it's Rooney. Out to the left it goes. Delph. That intervention was very necessary. Away from immediate danger. Choncho Shelby. Sterling. Oxlade Chamberlain. Oxlade Chamberlain! Just off target. Oxlade Chamberlain would have known he needed to generate more power behind that, but it just lacked the precision anyway. Milner gathers from the goal kick. And it's Sterling. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. England haven't yet dipped into their subs. Who's going to make this theirs? And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Well, for me, he had a very decent crack at it, but it has to be said that the odds on those from distance were never really that good, and you'd always favour the keeper in that instance. Forward it goes. Rooney. And it's Jagowiec. Smalling comes sliding in. Choncho Shelby. Rooney. Sterling. Rooney charges in. Jagowiec. Choncho Shelby is the guilty party there. Joe Shelby, tries a long pass towards the front. Now the pass. It's a long forward pass. Russia going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. Chirkov. Denisov. Spoon forward. Over hit and out of play. And for a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Chirkov. Well, maybe they're settling for what they have because they're not going to score from there. Russia with a corner and hardly any time left on the clock. England need to hold on for a few more moments. Now it's Rooney. Ignashevich has the route one option. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. He does seem to be in considerable discomfort. To hope it's nothing serious. John Joe Shelby pumps it forwards. Well positioned to make that interception. Oh, he's come flying in. And the referee brings it to a close. Well, whatever the shortcomings on either side, it was a great game to watch, just one between them. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? Well, listen, if you've got that kind of power and, and that kind of pace in your team, I think you'll plough through most teams. Those central areas tend to be very congested, lots of traffic.